Hello, traders. Happy Saturday. Welcome to episode 313 of Tea with Me and Trey. You could be doing anything. You could be out partying, doing bad things, you know, whatever. But you're here, and uh, quite frankly, I'm surprised and impressed. Thanks so much for being here. All right. Uh, not much changed really since the day stream. Uh, you know, we did a quick update today, but uh, we wicked down. As low as 35.96 before bouncing back up the upside. Really, who cares? Low volume, weekend warrior stuff, right? Can you hear me? Anyone? I don't know. Uh, this sucks, man. I'm a lefty, and this mic is like right here where my hand wants to be on the desk. I can't do it. It's the only like way I could come to a resolution. All right, with y'all being able to hear me with music, okay? So. If I hit that a couple times, it's just me getting used to it, all right? So, uh, just making sure your eardrums work. All right, man, 382 has been hit. High to low. There's the 382. We rejected it, immediately started selling off, all right? So we got a size 37.52, and then as low today, again, is 35.90 something, okay? And so now currently sitting at 36.33. And still making those higher lows, barely, and trying to get back above that 20 and 50 MA. You got to do that. We're not. All right. So just good to see a little bit more rejection, rejection, rejection. All right. Lower prices just can't do it, man. People keep just buying them up, buying up those uh, Bitcoins when they drop. For now, anyway. Okay. So, hey, man, I'm happy about one target. Let's, uh, our next aim is to get back up to that level 37.52, but then to really get to 39.32. That was the 618 from a high to low. All right. And then we're swinging for the fences for the 1272 extension. And in that case, man, life's going to be good. Okay. Because we're going to be up big money. Okay. So, all right, dude. That's it. Hope you brought your respective drinks, whether it's beer, wine, liquor. Cannabis, marijuana, uh, water. Okay, you gotta drink water, apple juice, whatever, doesn't matter. Uh, don't do hard stuff though, right? Don't think people are talking about mushrooms and stuff. Don't do that, man. That's uh, probably not good. I don't know, man. I bet this stream probably could be pretty interesting on that, but uh, we'll never know. What's up, Alex, dude? XRP for me. Crypto Toyga. So, uh, Mr. Kanatomo said, serves qualified automos automotive solutions. Bitcoin is mooning, folks, up 0.14%. Yeah, dude, all in. Mr. Kanatomo was the first dislike. Thanks, dude. Thank you. JD says, is this a bull run? Yeah, man, totally. Not doing much of anything. Happy weekend, Crypto Tiger. Whew. Oh, man. What's up, uh, Mad Carl? Uh, William Battles. Nexus of Hate. Rock flag and eagle baby, yeah, dude, yeah. What's up, uh, Michael S. Julia, what's up, Julia? This beer's for Julia, okay. The whole freaking thing, all right, because uh, she's busy and doesn't get to see us as much. But uh, sometimes on the weekends, she gets the luxury. So, what's up, MK man? Coming in on Cali. It's only eight o'clock in Cali, a lot earlier than here. 117 miles to Chicago. Let's roll. All right, William, man. The coming at you, W R A Y. Uh, radio waves or something, man. Who wants to bet Mitch is wearing a plaid lumberjack shirt? Yeah, dude. Lumberjack, man. Here I am. That's me, dude. This is a retro vintage color, too. It's like 70s galore right here, man. Colby wants a link. Yeah, dude, I saw you posted that uh, to me, dude. Yeah, we can look at it. We looked at length the U.S. dollar tether today, and it was holding a support. And, and we, you know, plotted it down seven channel, and this thing uh, fell below um, that horizontal line support. Phil Centurion knows all about it. But, uh, yeah, man, I mean, it's really still up on my screen. Really, if you want to look uh, what we're talking about. I don't know. I didn't plot it. I plotted it on, uh, I, dude, whatever. Right here. So that's the length of the US dollar, right? You had that uh, support, and we cracked it uh, just a couple hours ago when Bitcoin wicked down. This thing wicked down. Oh, well, it's it broke support and then you know fell all the way down to 43.5 cents and it bounced all the way up to around 45 cents currently. So 
whatever, dude. What's up, Juicy? Welcome back, man, for the second stream of the day. Zed Wrecked is Zerp. Wait, Zed Wrecked Zerps is your middle name, dude? What's up, M, M. Lily? Hey, I saw the tree you posted. It was a beautiful tree. M. Lily, thanks for that. What's up, Coach K? Ultra Instinct Jesus Man. The Washington Man. The Washington's the man. Hey, dude. Brandon. Hey, it's it's literally back there. You can't really see it very well, right? But uh, there it is, B. Washington. I mean, you tell me. It's the motherboard. How's it going, dude, right? KGB agent, man. KGB agent number 58 to $25. Let's play some games. Pays that man. Pays that man his money. He tricked me. 3.33% chance. Repeating a course of waking you up. I need to change that. I don't even know if you can do deci uh, decimals on stream elements. I just know you can do the round numbers. You probably can. Uh, it gives you the. I did 3.00, so 3.33% repeating, of course. Yeah, if you. The $25 tip now is a variation of there's a 3% chance that it will hit in any time it ever hits, whether it's day stream, night stream, you know, March, April, January, December. I have to chug a beer right there, right then and there. Okay, so. Yeah, man. Pay that man his, his money, man. Ah, give me that Oreo, dude. Give me that Oreo. Uh, KGB agent, 58. Thanks, dude. Gangs. All right. Anyway, so. Uh, yeah, man. Big coin. All right, well, first target. And uh, let's see if we can stay uh, outside of the downsloping 75% trend line of the equidistant channel, the much larger channel, right? That is very well respected. Okay, man. Let's see if we can uh, stay outside. And at least hit the secondary target, which would be great. I mean, dude, again, we've been uh, selling off for months now. We finally made a higher low, and then a slightly lower low than your previous low, but these these are still higher lows than this low all right selling is stalling tremendously uh, you can see exhaustion the high you know you got the bullish divergence down here not on the four hour not only on the four hour but you had a little bit of slight divergence on the daily all right and, and really right here you know from this little island to this one with the higher highs you did have a little bit of bearish divergence you really did okay it's not much man I mean, it's not even almost worth not noting, but it's there. Okay, so we had that, and we did break down because of that. Okay, after we hit the 382, so whatever. That's nothing. But uh, B. Washington, man, thanks for that uh, motherboard, dude. It's uh, working phenomenally. Okay, thank God. Really appreciate that, man. No subs or likes allowed. That's right, Mr. Kentoma, man. We have uh, moved to the CCCP, man. All right. Feel the rhythm, feel the ride, wake up, it's Bob in the pool time, oh my god, Bob in the pool dude, don't even, Bob in the pool was a formidable uh, hype boss, was he not, recently, good god, <sighs> don't make me man, don't make me, go crazy man, prost, it's, uh, it's been a good one though today, what's up about Rune Slayer? Crypto Cracker, Scoured Man, Hang with the Fam. All right, dude. How we going, dude? Oh, the audio's good, good. What's up, James Skinner? Looking forward to another great episode. Got your favorite beer with you right now, Root Beer. Hey, man, James Skinner. Uh, teach his own, right? Teach his own. Mitch said to take drugs, Mrs. Cantomo. Yeah, right, man. Yeah, right. All right, so William Battles has his uh, chocolate, hot chocolate and blue dream. All right, what are y'all drinking tonight? We got root beer, we got blue dreams, hot chocolate. What, do, what else do we have? This one has cannabis. Definitely a TA and Netflix kind of night, JD. Yeah, man, everyone went hard on Friday night, so they just relax on the, you know, Saturday night. Yeah, it's weird, Miss Cantoma. It really is weird. But uh, hey, what could you expect, dude? What's up, uh, Loco is free. Can we do TRX? Uh, yeah, yeah, we can 
Look at TRX again, which has been on tear. Notice it's in the title. All right. Uh, Alex, thanks, man. I don't know, dude. Awesome, dude. You're up uh, 3%. Yeah, it's more like a scalp, right, that you you took, right? You hit that bottom trend line. And we'll look at it. Yeah, for sure. So, Jimmy Katrina. Well, we're just getting through chat, right? B. Washington's getting some coffee, man. Also, Mobius, dude. How you doing up there? What would my definition of an S coin be? What about the people who are working to build quality projects, but the charts just don't show? Um, well, do they make money? Does something make money? And can it prove to me that it's going to make money? And is like, you know, long term sustainability? Uh, what, like, what's my incentive to put my money into that? Okay, normally you put your money into something because there's a way they can prove that they're going to increase the uh, price per share or price per coin in this situation and mostly nothing in this market can even do that. So. Is that a joint? Dwayne Alley Sondo Mountain Dew Herbert Camacho for President 2020. <sighs> I'll have what he's having. Thanks, uh, William Battles, dude, for... I don't know, that person had five or six names. I wish I had more than th three names, you know? I wish I had like four or five. Does anyone anyone in chat have more than three names? Uh, don't count junior or senior or anything like that. Does anyone have more than three names? Let me know, thanks. What's the drink word, chat? Phil Centurion, that's a good freaking question. Anyone? Do you have any uh, ideas? Is the Gartley playing out? Out of the res out of resistance? What you mean, homie? What you talking about? Uh, all I see is uh, we're. Dang, dude, why is that like that? That's weird. All right, so there's some support at the 3571. We didn't even hit that on the wick, right? The weekend warrior stuff. So, uh, I don't know, man. Is that a joint? Golden State Warriors minus two points. Beat Boston Celtics by four points. Billy, hope you like that free money. My record now 15 winners, three losers. Good luck. Love all my Jesus peoples. 888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888
So uh, holding support at 116.69, we just can't fall below it no matter what. We just tried again and failed. We even talked about, oh my God, we, in the day stream, we should just go back and look at it. We're talking about wait for confirmation. All right, we fell as low today. Even my alert went off too on Ethereum. But uh, we went as low as 112.34 before wicking back up and closing our candles at this trend line above it. Okay, so that's what we're talking about, confirmation. So uh, just look, the divergence continues on. We keep making more bullish divergence at the same levels of support, hmm, class B. Anyway, it's a descending triangle of some sort. Is it not? If we use the candle closes, it truly is some sort of descending triangle, which can break to the upside or downside, running out of room, are we not? If the heart line, the red downsloping trend line is the resistance and the horizontal line is the support, you have very little room left, okay? Maturation process is real. Uh, receding volume, right? Volume's uh, kind of dying off somewhat. All right. So uh, if Bitcoin breaks the upside, guess where Ethereum's going? To the upside. If Bitcoin dumps, Ethereum's going to finally crack this and have a candle close below it, but we have not seen one yet. Dang, dude. We haven't really been below this uh, trend line since enclosed below this trend line since uh, freaking December 21st. Over a month we've been above uh, 116.69. That's crazy, dude. On this chart, anyway. All right. They go on theory. What's up, Bradford, man? Brian Griffin. So, dude. What's up, about Ryan McEthrin, dude? Tron Connector's gonna get wrecked. Is that true, Jeff, man? Holy crap, dude. <clears throat> Jeez, man. Oops. Excuse me. We got talking about TNT, man. Dynamite! Dynamite. Alright, XRP about this man after XRP we'll look into some a uh, little bit of news for him. the emerging markets Asia what's going on over there man you'll find out okay man here's your XRP riding bottom beating a dead horse uh, currently we're holding between the 75% trend line and the heart line of the equidistant channel the extremely large well-respected equidistant channel man like oh my god how much more perfect could this thing be, dude? It's just like magic, man. All right, magic. Daily bullish convergence, approaching the critical support at around 30 cents. I don't know if we'll literally touch it again. We very well could, but if Bitcoin keeps running, if it goes to the upside, if it springs the upside on some volume, XRP is not going to hit that bottom. It's just going to go up with Bitcoin. So anyway, it's, uh, it's great, man. Great news. Um, great to see. XRP uh, finally stalling on some selling. I mean, we've really truly been selling off, making lower highs since uh, September 29th, right? That was it. Every time we rallied, it was a lower high than the previous high, lower high, lower high, lower high. Now we're still making those higher lows than our previous lows. All right, you better not crack that. You better not fall below that upsloping support or you're screwed, dude, okay? Very high chance you are screwed, okay? But someone's propping it up. Someone sees value at this uh, support for now. All right, great. <clears throat> Holy crap, man. APDUP, foam it into Tron, get wrecked, dude. Be ready to get wrecked. Whew. Yeah, Tom H, all them squiggles, me and Buku Bucks. Yeah, dude. Am I bullish on the market in general this year at all? Uh, not really. I mean, there's no trend. Uh, there's no bullish trend right now. So no, I'm not bullish. But I'll tell you, I think we are exhausted from the November 14th sell-off. And I feel like the structure we have developed on Bitcoin currently after the huge sell-off uh, is showing exhaustion. And so I think that a major retrace is coming. But uh, 
you know, say we make that major retrace at some point in the coming month or two. Uh, we're probably going to make much lower highs than our previous highs back from November 14th, November 7th. And uh, we're going to sell off again. And there's probably going to be really reliable bearish divergence on a daily time scale. There's probably going to be a pattern that's bearish. There's probably going to be all kinds of things because Bitcoin loves doing that. Okay, it's very reliable uh, with a TA. So, so uh, Alan Ellis, Jeffrey Gorbakov, Stalin, Putin probes growl the fourth. Dang, dude, are you related to a czar? Holy crap, man. Brandon Washington says Justin Sun, uh, Sun is a young CEO of a very big crypto that took all. Oh, yeah, Tron Connect, right? It is a good project. Uh, what he has can become something great, but he has big shoes. He created a work into. He, Brandon Washington congratulates him. Yeah, man, that's, that's, that's cool, man. But uh, hey, what's in it for me? Uh, can they show me and prove to me that if I put money into their project, uh, that it's going to yield me a return? They can't right now. Okay, they can't. So uh, great to trade great to ride the waves but when the trend breaks man that thing can and will and does all the freaking time go back to very low levels uh so again man it's all there's all the stuff on these charts man uh there's no intrinsic value behind them really yet okay which is fine you know So let's go to uh, make sure I got this right. Holy crap, man! <laughs> Things insane. Uh, okay. Man, I would be so careful, dude, on a long. I mean, like this is probably not gonna make higher highs here. But hey, man, it's the link. It's nuts. Uh, I don't know, we haven't looked at it kind of in a second, but it just continued marching on up, right? Uh, dude, just so freaking beautiful. It really is. Uh, gotta love the episode of Channel. Mitch, my you drink and be happy tonight. Please look at CHK, do the chart on CHK. I rented a lawnmower to get to Green Bow. You rented a lawnmower to get to Green Bow? Come on, dude. Come on to Greenbow, dude, with the lawnmower. They, uh, that's all we drive down here, you know? So if you go to some really cool climate, uh, I think the most northern city in the world, I think it's in, like, like I don't even know, like Finland or Norway or something like that, they uh, don't have cars. They have snowmobiles. In Alabama, they have only tractors, okay? So you don't drive cars. You just drive tractors, okay? So, uh Thanks, man, for the 333 repeating, of course. Drink and be happy tonight. All right, man. You asked for it. You asked for it. Good God. What am I supposed to do? From a high to low, all three major fib extensions were cracked and destroyed. Yeah, I just can't even, man. Can't even. Um, currently, I'll be just bouncing off the bottom trend line of the channel we cracked and broke out of. Unreal, dude. All right. So, uh, you know, we thought we had a... Ascending Rodney Wedge of some sort. I thought we did, and uh, we just broke above it. But, yep, let's see. I mean, from this side to these highs, clear divergence, right? Uh, it's, it's really crazy, though, because, like, you kept on moving up and you kept staying the same. I just, uh, wow, man. Link is defying gravity. It's been defying gravity since, I believe, August. August, man. All right, this thing's just been running. Just been running like a king. So, uh, anyway, Colby has a different channel. Let's, uh, get rid of this real quick. Try to make sense. Draw it like he did. I think he just had it like, uh, what was it, man? The one and two up here? Nah, that couldn't have been it. Right? I mean, that was really the way one should have probably had it. And look what happened when we cracked it, right? We cracked it, back tested, then dumped. Okay, so uh, let me see. Okay, so you got yours like. So you're using the bottom. Alright, I gotcha. Like this, maybe? 
can really tell. I think you are. Dude, how in the world? Okay, I think I get it. You're looking at this little area here. Connecting it like that somehow. Okay. All right. Interesting. But, uh, I don't know, man. Not much, uh... I guess you get a couple touch points on your heart line, somewhat. But I think it was. Jeez, man. It seems like it was more like this, and then you just had those crazy exaggerations. Um, dude, if you have it like that, man. <laughs> I mean, look, it's just another one of those ascending, broadening wedges, right? Bearish. You know the crazy thing about this, if it is that. You know what the target is? The target will be down here at like uh, 9,050. Really? It, dude, that is ex Wow. The way you have this, man. Like that, I guess. Something like that. Know, does that go down to one more? Yeah, it sure does. Oh my god, man. Megaphone, baby. Megaphone. This thing can't hold up, man. Can't hold up, dude. Target is the bottom of the pattern. Really, the bottom of the pattern, I guess, for you is down here. But um, it kind of looks like it started like here or here. Really, because that's your anchor point. That's the way you anchored it, right? <sighs> Good lord, man. Good freaking lord. All right. It's a lot of legs up. And uh, be careful here. Because, you know, from this side to this side, you had bearish divergence. Ooh, the daily. Jeez. Well, of course. Yeah, man, that happens when I, um... So annoying. I have to manually change everything every time. Okay, so you did have the RSI bearish divergence, didn't you? You had a little bit. I mean, you really had triple RSI bearish divergence. See that daily time scale helped. Hmm. All right, man. That's it, dude. That's a. Uh, it's very high, very fast. Okay, so. All right, you, you scalping here, but where's your exit? You know, where are you gonna take profit? And what if this is in the swing low? What if we keep dumping afterwards? So, uh, every time we made highs, higher highs, we're seeding volume in the bearish divergence, all right? So, I mean, you even had some bearish divergence on the MACD from a high to a higher high, right? Lower levels. Some sort of megaphone. I know you had a channel. That's cool. But uh, I don't know, man. This thing is a high flyer in this market. A high, high flyer. Right. Let's see what happens when we do this, man. Interesting. Very interesting. Making an adjustment here, right? These anchor points back here from May and April, right? Uh, this touch point's up there. Look what happens when you get up here to the top. Very, very interesting. Okay, and I know you keep doing that, but uh, look, man, you get the heart line right there, and look at this beautiful 25% respect here. So maybe a new way to interpret uh, the way this channel is supposed to look, right? Awesome. Good trunk in it. Alright, Tron Connect broke out. You've been running. It's been going well. Starting to show some bearish divergence now on daily time scale. 
Actually, no. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, because the candle closed. I know it's... Hold on, let me, uh... So making technical higher highs than your previous high now, and much lower levels of uh, positive momentum, relative strength, right? So it could be, you know, it could be getting close on the daily. Uh, but hey, great news here! Great freaking news on Tron. We broke the 236, 2.7 cents, 2.8 cents. Man, that one has been extremely tough to crack. Uh, but we did it, man. We did it. We got a candle body close above it. As like, you know what? four or five hours ago the daily finally closed above it let's see if we can sustain prices above this keep on running that'd be awesome man. okay but uh, something to take into consideration when we're looking at the the daily bearish divergence it can make a lot of sense what's going on here okay we'll do this in the day stream it was like one of the last things we looked at but here you are man hey we made it up we made it to the freaking 886 awesome on tron it pumped hard while we were eating dinner and doing whatever we were. But this is a bearish bat pattern. It is identical, it is perfect. It meets the criteria perfectly. We were down here, um, just waiting. Okay, 88.6% retrace, here it is. Okay, so uh, positive momentum's been building, but we're overbought. And uh, what'll happen is in this area, this is when people would start shorting this asset. Okay, that's it. Short it and then you could fit from a low to wherever the high ends up being. Uh, 382, 618, 1272 down here. Okay, so bearish bat pattern developed on Tron Connect, but in the uh, parameters of a nice, upsloping, well respected channel. Awesome. Okay, that's it for now on Tron. Stoner man, missing change. Just going up a little bit. Shoes are bad, MK Julia. That's right. That's right. AP hey, Miller, good to see you, dudes. Glad you're here. We have XRP is almost at 589. Billy man, get wrecked, dude. slices here awesome dude thank you try and disconnect that's it man that's it oh wait I forgot to read about some news real quick All right some stuff going on <clears throat> happening emerging Asia market rebound in sight with China trade caveats <sighs> this year's looking a little brighter for Asia's emerging market assets amid prospects of less aggressive Federal Reserve uh, but uh, the US China trade war saga and its impact on growth will keep traders on their toes that's according to 14 strategists traders and investors surveyed by Bloomberg Malaysia's ringgit was their favorite of eight regional currencies as the nation's central bank is seen as unlikely to ease policy while for bonds china was the top pick for equities india which will host a presidential election this year ranked number one while the philippines was at the bottom a more flexible fed is definitely positive for asia while the u.s trade spat has already been priced in and has shown some signs of improvements supporting the scenario of a rebound said koji Fukuya, uh, Chief Executive Officer at FPG Securities Company in Tokyo. Given the region's close trade relations with China, issues involving the Chinese economy is a very important factor driving Asian markets. All right. Biggest drivers for emerging Asian markets, uh, U.S. trade spat is number one, China's economy number two. Uh, number three is the Federal Reserve's rate path which is pretty good, right? Uh, four, global growth outlook. Five, foreign fund flows. Six is oil and commodity prices. 
The number seven is local central bank monetary policy. Eight is local election, and nine is geopolitical risks. Okay. The Bloomberg J.P. Morgan Asia Dollar Index started the year marginally higher, rising about 0.5% uh, so far this year as of late Friday in Asia after dropping 4% in 2018, uh, the most since 2015. The MSCI Emerging Market Asia Index of Equities has gained 5.4% following a 17% decline. Asia's local currency bonds have made little headway this year. All right. Anyway, so that's just a little bit of reading on what's going on in China. Okay. So, anyway. No one cares. Right. Everyone's here to drink or not. Mixed Depth Charge, or Drop Shot, Western Canada, is a mixed drink that is made by mixing two drinks. A drink in a small glass, typically a shot glass, is dropped into a larger glass holding a different drink. Challenge all my drinking buddies to have one. I thought that was called a boiler maker. Anyone? Anyone agree with me on that? A boiler maker? All right, thanks, uh, Wreckable Depth Charge. The 333 repeating, of course, thank you. Okay. Very cool. ADA is doing things, stupid things, but things nonetheless. Is that true, Julia? Sure is. Hey, it's okay though. That's okay, right? Here it is. Here's your ADA, Julia. We're breaking out of the down seven channel. Uh, what we would expect and hope to see Bitcoin maybe do soon, but uh, the up seven channel, right? Uh, here we are. We're approaching that support. Eleven sixty three could be a potential area of value. Uh, about, here's the two hundred moving average as well. All right, so I don't think we have any kind of patterns right now, but uh, just channel bound, channel bound like kings. This is the exact same price action that Tron had. Uh, wicked up, hit some critical resistance points, and sold off uh, below the 236. But now Tron has broken above the 236, uh, unlike ADA right now. So ADA is not following Tron Connect so much anymore. But look at this, man. Look at this uh, impulse up and then down slipping consolidation. And look at the volume receding here. Maybe, just maybe, we'll get a nice bounce soon. Okay. And maybe it'll be right off the bottom trend line of the little channel. Sweet, man. Okay. 88, zoom out. Jeez, dude. Uh, just insane, right? Insane downtrend that stems back to May 3rd. And uh, we broke out of the channel. We didn't really do anything. We made uh, one more lower low. And then that was it. Then we started running, right? So uh, we plotted for that. It seemed like a likely channel. And we we're now moving to the upside, okay? But. Uh, not really doing anything yet uh, trending i mean no real trend yet just because look man you got to break above a november 6 level november 6 man that's like uh, uh you have to break that and so uh, if you want to start seeing uh, a, a bullish trend occur you've got to start the first thing you have to do is break previous resistance levels previous resistance previous resistance over and over and over again and we have not done that yet okay so Maybe you want to set up an alert on ADA. Got one on like 1275 or something like that. Yep. So if we could crack that, man, it might be a nice move the other side. But from a high to low, we expect 1500 to 1900 sats. Okay, between the 382 and the 618 on ADA. I don't know if we'll get there anytime soon, if we ever do. All right. That's it, man. There's your ADA. Awesome. Oh wait, Oops. sorry. Good lord. All right. Here's a Chesapeake Energy Corporation or Czech Cola. Others, a uh, nice downsloping channel. It looks like 
looks like we found some support right around that uh, February of 2016 level, that low, and we have bounced. But uh, this is just to give you a zoomed out view on the daily, kind of the trend we're in. A little bearish, right? It's okay. Wow, man. Let me talk about have not made. We made a shallow retrace at the 236 before dumping, making lower highs on our previous highs and selling off again. Okay, wow. So very, very weak, this uh, asset. Terrible. Had a little upsloping channel, one, two, three on the top, and one on the bottom, two on the bottom. Uh, and then we broke it, but then we, when we broke, again, we uh, made a nice bounce. The upside got oversold mid-December. And that's, uh, that's really about it right now. You can see clearly this 25% trend line, equidistant channel of the equidistant channel is just we can't break it. We cannot sustain prices above it. We sell off, right? So uh, let's zoom in some. Uh, I really do think we've got something going on here. Let's get rid of that. I like a back test. Back test 317. But I think there's probably some other support, right? Mm -hmm. Not really. Had something like that and couldn't we broke out of it a couple times okay and uh, yeah man something like that either way man just down sloping over and over and over okay and really this could be what else, what else man what's new dude uh, just anchoring one and two here Here and here, and somewhat of a uh, God, dude. That's pretty much just a downsloping channel, man. I guess, right? But uh, slightly diverging away. Could make it perfect on the uh, with the channel tool, that parallel channel tool. So, um, whatever, man. Uh, do we have the one two seven two? Probably not. You go from your low to high. Oh my God, that's what it was. So from your low to high, we had a 1272 and bounced tremendously. Holy crap. And we did have a little bit of daily bullish divergence. Okay. Sweet. Okay, good. So there you go. That is now more sense being made. Okay. Getting your fib extensions out and seeing that's so perfect, is it not? Perfect bounce. All right, man. Um, so we now we know what we bounced off of doing the investigation. So now we can uh, fib. I mean, really, this is a high. This is a swing high to low. 38% retrace. Okay, so we're stalling at this 382 at 293. Uh, but we know the common retrace zone. It, we could run all the way up to 369, and it really wouldn't be that weird because that's the golden retrace, and that's. Just part of it, man. That's your fibs. You could easily run up there. All right. So, uh, huge spike in positive momentum. Uh, no bearish divergence yet, but losing positive momentum. So, uh, maybe we run again if the macro does, right? 330, 367. Those are targets that uh, could be possible. All right. For Chesapeake Energy. But uh, extremely bearish, man. Extremely bearish trend you're in. That's it. Depth charge. I've never heard of depth depth charge, but now I do it. I know now. Right? Star Wars World. What's up, dude? Welcome, to Star Wars Worlds. He's been summoned, dude. supposed to chart this but uh, this is your AXXA X group it's like the X-Men 
Because we can try, man. We can try. I mean, here's a, here's a swing high. It's a low. Good God. Hitting a 50% retrace. Cracking above it. All right. From your discernible high to low, that's what's going on. Okay. Uh, really tough to do anything, right? Because you had a channel, and now the channel's been broken, right? You broke out of the channel. That's it. So it's kind of hard to do anything else. I mean, I don't know if this would make any sense here. You see, not even, even like there, that angle is being broken, right? Currently. So uh, we'll see how that plays, man. But hey, man, you're you're hitting uh, an area where you could be reach or you could start uh, reversing your price action. Okay. Uh, why are we pulling back some, dude? We got extremely high on the RSI. Uh, we got to 86, 86 a few days ago. Uh, we have not seen 86 on the RSI since back in May of uh, 2018. Okay, so. Um, what are you saying about real estate and crypto? Is that what it is or something? Okay, so I guess we'll just plot Just for the heck of it this trend line that's already been broken whatever That's it though, man. Okay, so no divergence at all. No bearish divergence. Nice volume. Uh, I don't really know man It's just running up and high to low. There you go. We could run up to 3.5 cents two and then sell off or we can make a deep retrace at 786 at 4.4 cents and then sell off right but uh, no um, no indication to believe we're gonna sell there's no bearish divergence okay because we get the date daily yeah nothing there either right positive momentum's hot a bullish convergence on both oscillators that's it so far okay Man, so it's been a nice run. You missed probably most of it. Okay. No telling how this crap goes to the This is like insane. Okay, this is crazy. Good luck, dude, on your OTC. Oof. Okay. Brent. There you go, dude. Can I say hi to your wife, Emma? Vio? Hey, Emma. How are you doing today or tonight? I hope it's going wonderful and. You and Vo are enjoying yourselves watching the stream. Thank you all for watching. Really appreciate that. It's an honor. stream we, we get that sometimes but it's a uh, pretty rare man it doesn't happen just since the frequency of my streaming just doesn't happen that much so up uh, Sam easy hey Devin dude howdy to you man Where's Bitcoin bouncing at? Well, it bounced it to 3,500 or whatever, right? Or 3,590, excuse me. I don't know. That's that's where it bounced. I don't know. I don't do scalping, so I'm looking at more uh, significant time scales. Not worrying about the wicks as much as others, but that's okay. Dang, man. How's that too quiet now? We have uh, only one Devon, I believe. Multiple Derricks. Maybe we have more than one Devon.
What's the ticker? What's the ticker, uh, Rune Slayer, dude? Thanks, Star Wars World, man. Love you too, dude. Like one jump back on LCW. What? What's up, Truce? What does that mean, dude? You're the crypto comedian, Truce, man? Uh-oh. <sighs> trying to play a drinking game in my head, I guess. Alright, trying. I believe the Tronk Connect beer server the daily. Yes, Devin, I have. I truly have. And I also looked at the bear shop at... Hello, Mitch. Guys, the bottom is near Bitcoin. May hit 2750 soon, and from there will go up non stop. All right, Star Wars Worlds. Well, hey, man, what if we don't hit it for a while and we hit other targets, higher prices, and then we sell off and hit those targets and then we run up? That could make sense, but that could also take us like six months to a year, right? So, uh, thanks, dude, for the 10, dude. You're awesome, man. Seriously. And just thanks for uh, the support for all this time, dude. It means everything, man. Aromatherapy. Yeah, dude. For real. Interesting. Can we look at DCR again, P. Miller? Sure, man. Uh, I don't think we've we moved much since last time we looked at it, right? Talked about this one being range bound, do we not? To some extent. All right, you got the uh, horizontal line resistances, supports. Okay, and uh, I don't know, man. It, you're you're upsloping right now, which is great. You're above all three moving averages. You just had a golden cross, but hey, man, a lot of chop. Okay, so golden crosses may not be very reliable. Okay at this point. I mean, what do you do with that wick, dude? Do you just ignore it? I mean, there is some slight upsloping support right now. It looks like it could have been a ascending triangle, but it's not. It's not one, dude. All right, just something like that. That's uh, probably gonna be respected in the future, but uh, you just can't break this resistance of uh, 5,000 to 5,000 75 is just there and just and not been broken. Okay, so Crypto Kai, the master of the RSI coming to you from the buttermilk and Nutella studios in Greenbow, Alabama Look out for the Israelites. Could you check on XLM? Here are some twos two 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 Yeah, man. Thanks so much uh, Desmond Decker for the 589 Thanks, dude. Um, Desmond Decker, a Jamaican <clears throat> ska, rock steady, and reggae singer, songwriter, and musician. There you go, man. Thanks, uh, Desmond, for the reggae. Yoda. Drink for biddies. <laughs> Drink for biddies. Uh, Julia, two biddies equals two cents, and it's not even because Twitch takes about 30% of that. So, uh, drink for the. No I like the noise that I'll drink for the specific. Uh, uh, I don't know, audio, auditory pleasure I get out of the noise a bit. I might just change the Jesus chimes to the bit noise. So, every time someone tips me, it's that noise because it's a, it's a good sound, right? You gonna make the uh, jar explode now? I don't think anyone's even made the jar explode yet since uh, we got the Red Ripper back. There you go, Julia. I left the mic open for you. And uh, yeah, sweet. Okay. Uh, let's 
So uh, yeah, DCRP Miller Man, maybe like you see up slipping support, whatever, a small slight warm up accumulation, who cares? Um, but you'd expect and try to see us hit 5,020. And if one could short this, this is a low risk short entry. Low risk longs, low risk shorts. High risk long, high risk shorts, right? So uh, range bound is the best way you could look at this. Okay, it's tough, man, it's tough. Anyway, it's weird. That's weird. But we did break the downsloping channel, did we not? <sighs> Excuse me. <laughs> so we get XLM again, right? <laughs> Biddy chimes. Oh yeah, Biddy Chimes. The Biddy Chimes. Thanks, Julia. Alright, yeah, it looks like it's continuing to sell off, is it not? Hmm. Uh, but we talked about in the day stream on XLM. A beautiful downsloping channel, right? Nice little structure. We got support at 9.6. 0.96 cents and 9.3.69 cents. Good God, all the nine sixes and six nines, dude. All right, you do have support that is uh, horizontal. We cracked and fell below the December 6 low. That sucks, but there is a little bit more support. Uh, the fact that we're getting more bullish divergence is great. Okay, so you're making slightly lower prices with higher levels of relative strength, and it seems like probably lower levels of the negative momentum. Grubs, man. Ha. Grub. Oh, Thread Ripper. It looks like it's serving its purpose. It's not uh, lagging out, right? With all the Kappas. Thanks, dude, for the Kappas, man. The 1,050 biddies, man. All right. Whew. Holy crap. But uh, we would expect at some point a nice little break to the upside on XLM. Okay, let's go. We just can't break above the 20 and 50 moving average. That sucks, dude. And, of course, if we... Eventually couldn't hold 9.3 cents. We got fib extensions down here. All right, seven, seven point eight cents. Good God. All right, but we're hoping that doesn't happen with uh, what Bitcoin's kind of doing right now. All right, this thing looks like it's about ready. Um, and it look 88 percent retrace, just right around it. Okay, could reverse our price action anytime. Oh, Lumia bot's not on? It was. All right, Lumia bot is now on. There you go, Julia. Okay. Whoop. Oh, man. I connect my Hue bridge? What happened? Hold on. Go to settings. I have to do this weird ritual. All right, give it a shot. Julie, give the light light change a shot, okay? What was that? I don't know. Oh, it's restarting now. Okay, should be good now. Should be good now. Let me know. <sighs> Sucks, I don't think it's changing. Crap. Let me see here. Nice, it does work. It just no one uses Twitch, so we're good. Julia, thanks for. That's where it cuts off. I see you say seems good, seems good, man, seems good. Thanks, Julia Guskuski. Thanks so much for the biddies. Holy crap.
you're trying to figure out what's going on here, dude. Uh, it's a Saturday night technical analysis stream. Um, we work hard, we play hard. That's really what's going on. YP, man. Looking at charts. Just relaxing. That's it, dude. Is something to do with the Israelites, man? I don't understand. Skyward, man. Hey, dude, Skyward, man. Thanks for the 777 repeating, of course. It's kind of weird. Where, where's the message, dude? Did you not have anything to say to me at all? You just cold shouldering me, dude? <laughs> kind of disappointed, dude. Was looking forward to hearing something. Okay. Kangs, dude, nevertheless. Appreciate you, dude. No, you too, man. You've been around for so freaking long, man. Showing your support, and, uh, dude. I'm just so grateful to have you and many others in this chat in my freaking life, okay? You all have no idea. I wish I could articulate the amount of gratitude I have for everyone in here, but uh, words just don't do freaking justice, okay, man? That's it. Uh, if we could grow to 10,000 subs, uh, Vegas, but, uh, dude, things have just stalled lately with Bitcoin stalling, too, so... But again, Israelites and reggae music, Billy, is that what he sang about or something? I don't know. Thanks, Mac Daddy. I appreciate that, dude. Cheers to you, man. Confused, man. Oh, CKJ crew in the house. Sweet man, I appreciate y'all being here and uh, wonderful, wonderful uh, to have you. We're just relaxing tonight uh, and just analyzing things. We've analyzed a decent amount. We've already just we talked about uh, Asian markets too. How they're holding up. The biddies look so smooth, Phil Censure. For now, man. Yeah, for now, dude. For now. Oops. Or is that not is that not able enabled? Crap. That's weird. Why would it not be enabled? Thanks for the follow, whoever that was, on Twitch. Watch up. King Logan's eating some Philly cheesesteak with Vegemite. Oh my god. Sounds awful. Can you change the lights via YouTube? No, you cannot, Zed Serps man. I felt like if I did that, dude, I would like the chat would be spamming lights all the time, right? So there was only one way to really do it, and it was just do Twitch to incentivize people to watch on that platform, but eh, whatever, right? <clears throat> I like anchovies, is that a service man? All right. It's good. I hate the uh, the little bones, though. The bones can be really obnoxious, right? That's a song by Desmond Decker, dude. Why is he talking about uh, Israel, dude? Okay. Thanks, Alex, man. Much love. Thank you, Julia. Yeah, I know. I wish we could do party lights, Julia. I haven't figured it out, okay? I mean, I could. I could spend all night on here, right, looking at it. But, uh, I don't really know how to do it, so. We get a music after stream party, Runeslayer? I don't know, man. Uh, we've done it before, right? Done it before. You're all in at $888.88 for a ripple, right, Kappa? Look out. Choose the option to not show light notification in chat. Huh. Really, Crypto Tiger? I don't know if that's possible, man, because uh, how could that be possible? YouTube is very, do they do not have, like, Twitch is way ahead on all kinds of stuff with chat, emojis, and all that in chat. Uh, Twitch definitely is the king of streaming still, okay? It's just, uh, YouTube's dragging along. They're specifically static videos and they're branching into streaming more right so that's garment 
I had to break the seal. Good God. Okay, uh, let's go back, man. Let's go. I've been live now in an hour and 11 minutes. Good God. Let's go to Bighorn again. There's more to talk about, dude. There's just not. I mean, what more could you even want? A bullish Gartley pattern, a harmonic that has uh, hit one target already, and we're looking for the second one, 39.32. Well, we really want to hit the first target again, 37.82, right? Because we couldn't do anything but wick off of it. Uh, cool, though, that we did hit that. and had a little bit of bearish divergence, maybe the reason why we sold off. And we're now below the 20 and 50 moving average, which sucks. Okay, but you're holding some sort of support at 35.71. You just can't fall below it. We didn't even touch it this little wick we had a few hours ago. <laughs> Should be in the setup on OBS or something? No way it's going to be on OBS, dude. OBS is its own thing. And then you've got uh, Lumia, the app that uh, it, uh, I don't know. Let me, let me see. Settings real quick to see chat settings. Mm -mm. Yeah, nothing about chat uh, will it let you have it hidden. That would be wonderful. And would fix any kind of issue, right? A reluctance I would have to put this on YouTube, because then it'd be like party lights all the time. But uh, dude, that is, I can't. Um, I don't think I can do better. Yeah, dude, it's gonna show up no matter, no matter what. Okay. Started. <clears throat> it was 420 in Straya. SD, is that true? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. It's okay. Don't feel bad because if you miss 420, you can just wait for 422 or something. Right? Yeah, I did. Rune Slayer, I did. We had a little descending triangle, broke the upside, and uh, we're close to that measured move of the descending triangle. It's wonderful, Rune Slayer. Awesome to see gold be awesome like that. And, and it correlates with the gold um, selling off down almost a percent on Friday. Okay. Yeah, find it. Please, Crypto Tiger. I'd love to change it. Okay. Yes, Mac Daddy. Yes. Absolutely. That's how one would trade this. Yes. More party lights, Alex. You hear that, Julia? Alex wants more party lights. Okay. Hold on, though. Let me uh, let me run the bathroom real quick. Okay. I'm not gonna go BRB. I'm just gonna mute my mic. All right, y'all. Figure out some drinking game for me to play. Be right back.
Hey, what's up? I'm back. Whatever, man. We're good. Thanks to the nearly 100 people still watching. Uh, not a very eventful evening, it seems, right? We've had way more eventful evenings than this one. Just uh, another Saturday night stream. I don't know, dude, since uh, Proof of Market's died down, Saturdays are always pretty chill. Right, but, uh, anyway. 618-3932, and then the 1272-4431, those are targets. Let's just stay above at least 3571, and everything else should be fine. <clears throat> okay? That's it, dude. This thing should take off at some point. It should, man. All right, but if it doesn't, hey, man, it's just a failed trade. No big deal. Failed trade where you already hit one target. Whatever. Yeah. So it serves as Gorilla Glue. Sweet. So very caffeine, dude. SD Rage Quits. Here I am, hanging out at the Hampton Inn, man. The hotel. All quiet on the crypto front, dude. Yeah, Randy. Yeah, dude. Okay. So, I've been live like an hour and 20 minutes or so. Um, Finish up this beer. What's up, Fogel, man? You like the light change? Yeah, man, it's pretty cool, dude. Right? Pretty cool. Might just go out tonight and go uh, crazy, right? What's up, Beast Lights, man? You the party lights, man. Party lights. Crazy world, dude. Chat's lit, man. Chat's lit with the color changes. <clears throat> Kyler Murray to the Raiders. Oh, yeah, Billy, man. Is that true? Is that your team, dude? Oakland? Oh, my God. T-Rex banging so hard, am I getting dieted? I don't know, man. Getting dieted by that bearish bat pattern, remember? Bearish bat pattern. Russia tip $25. Russia never loses. No whammies. Also, can you take a peek at Ulti? Defies all logic. Cloud storage company? Vich ain't doing things. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mother Russia. Thanks for the $25 con contribution. $25 contribution. Yeah, look at Ulti. Yeah, man. Of course. The ultimate software group. Oh my god, dude. You want to talk about... Hold on. All right, let's look at the daily. Can't see anything. Here you go, dude. We're looking for a cipher, huh? A beautiful little bear cipher pattern, dude.
Make sure I am 70%. Alright, those be see the criteria here. Alright, let's uh let people see, man. Let's let people see. What's going on here, dude? Okay. so I can like go back and forth like I do. That's almost good if we can get a picture big enough. What is it? Alt scroll? Mm -mm. Okay, man. Probes, man. Uh, thanks, dude. This is beautiful, dude. This is freaking beautiful, man. I mean, like, you can't get more textbook than this, okay? So let's look at it. All right, so X to A, that's the impulse. There is nothing that you need to know except X to A. X to A, there it is, all right? <clears throat> when we retrace from X to A, we will retrace between 38% and 62%, all right? So from X to A, we retrace that much between 38% and 62%. Do you see? Criteria, next day. What do we do? We retraced 41% fine within the parameters of the requirements that we need. But then when we finally top out, that's Julia with the 500 biddies, boom. Then we'll break down and we'll make a lower low, okay? And uh, the way we look at that is from from your swing low to swing high, we retrace between uh, 1.272 and 1414. Where are we? We are between that. We're at the 126% retrace between 113% and 141%, 126.7%. There it is, criteria met. And then your last leg uh, from C to D. All right, what you would do is from your high to low, you would retrace between 127% and 200% from B to C, okay? When we uh, run up to this level to hit the 786, which is your last criteria from X to C, from X to C, <laughs> uh, we would run and retrace 78% of the way, okay? So uh, that's right here, and that's gonna put us, both of these kind of have to line up together. All right, so uh, this is where the target pretty much is to short uh, ulti. Okay, ulti, we're looking to short around $308. Probes men, okay. Fantastic, bearish cipher pattern, ladies and gentlemen. A little bit of education on Saturday night with a beer in our hands. We are gangs. <sighs> gotta love it, dude. Gotta love ciphers. Gotta love harmonics, man. There's just nothing like them. Probes, man. Thanks, dude. Very, very cool. How was that good, man? Probes, was that good? Do you see SD? This is me at the Grand Canyon. No crypto tiger. I've not looked at chat commands and stream elements. I don't even know where, really where to look there. Okay. What's a bearish bat pattern? Uh, bearish bat pattern is uh, they've got different criteria, right? Uh, this is similar to a bearish bat, but the bearish bat, you go to Tron Connect. Notice on the daily, we go from the major high to low. Okay, major high to low. This is your bearish bat. X, A, B, C, D. Criteria perfectly met. 
All right. Uh, the way I've learned about harmonics is you don't have to use the wigs if you don't want to, as long as you use the candle bodies. That's fine. We do it like that. We have now finally hit target. We have hit the 886. These are the areas where people would short. People would go short on Tron Connect at these areas. That's it. That's literally freaking it, man. Even though we broke above the Harlan, I get it, man. This is a, a trade, and uh, it could fail, of course. No big deal. Can stop loss set up. One can just have their stop set up a little bit higher. All right, so we got this. Uh, you would have your stop set up maybe a little bit around 31.85 cents. Maybe a little bit higher if you wanted to be a little liberal. Okay, but when we make that swing high from a low to high, we get our three. 382-618-1272. Okay, those are the targets. Sweet man. There's your bat. Uh, Ryan McEtherin. It's a bearish pat tonight. Yeah, dude, it's weird. That book, the book I have shows it is bearish pat. They didn't even proofread that. Whatever. Weird. So about 10 minutes. Yeah, we actually looked at Cardano. Oh, wait, did we? Yeah, we looked at Cardano tonight, didn't we? Yeah, we covered it. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> oh, I've been into the arts of technical analysis for going on seven years now, Alex, man. Did y'all break the lights? No, never mind. Do you see billion batters? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm so bored. To dab. <laughs> Holy crap. Blue Dow Jones Industrial Bears Divergence. Oh, we just could not find any of that, could we? One G Projects here. It's a party now. It's a party here. Ulti for the win. Thanks, pros, man. Yeah, short around the 300 area. Hopefully it's up there when we're in LA. And maybe, probably so, dude. The way we looked at it, that thing looks like we'll probably be, the, probably be there in March, right? We go back to ulti. That's going to be around... Uh, no, nah, dude. It, March is way out here. Yeah, I'll be in March around this time. But yeah, maybe it'll stall and take its time. It won't get there. Like, dude, it could be like this if it wants to, right? It can do that. Whatever, dude. Okay. Doesn't really matter. Either way, though, it's like so freaking beautiful, dude. So freaking fantastic. All right. But remember, from your high to low, 50% retrace, uh-oh. Oof, you expect us to go higher there. Oh, no, there's no real school for TA. I mean, like, no, I did not go to college for TA, man. Uh, pretty much went for broadcasting, funny enough, right? But did not do that. University of Phoenix Online Kappa. Is it a party, man? Is it a party, 1G? On what, dude? 15 more likes for 100? I don't know if we'll get there, man. Okay. I don't know. As of late, it's been tough. It's been a major, major feat to get 100 likes these days. Okay. You can put an alert on anything. Uh, you can't, probes, you cannot put a, an alert on a fib node. That's what I've learned. You cannot put an alert on a fib node. Get wrecked, dude.
Sorry. It's whatever, man. Holy crap. Julia for the highs <laughs> Ron McEtherine says he took finance and we just learned a bunch of useless equations yeah dude, it, they, that stuff has nothing to do with technical analysis right so I took like advanced economics and I mean doesn't it's just oh supply and demand with a little game theory sprinkled in okay College does not teach TA. Nicholas is glad he kept his Tron. Yeah, dude. Right, Nicholas? Just uptrending now, but uh, barely batting or padding. You see me on both platforms, that deserves to be good, dude. TRX replaces Bitcoin? Yeah, breaking news, man. Breaking news. Total biddies are now 888 in honor of King Logan. There you go. Boom. Minus 16 degrees Celsius. What's your project, man? I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. Are waking me up, man. That white light, it kills me, dude. <sighs> I need to like take a course on this app for the lights so we can make it real fun. No fib note alerts. Boom, get destroyed, dude. Yep, you have to put a horizontal line in place. Yep. Is that alert? Yep. It's a scam. It's a total scam, probes, man. Down with the system, dude. By Bitcoin and hard all. <laughs> That's it, right? Isn't that the whole thing, dude? Okay, anyway. Kang's upsloping channel, and uh, yeah, you get it, dude. Beautiful, beautiful uptrend, man. Cheat mode. What is it? Uh, cheat codes? was like that really and he like broke out derp just like everything else right that's nice though right that's real nice all right man right at the heart line and the uh 50 percent retrace geez man right at the same place confluent man Where's the dame tonight? Where's your, what you talking about, dude? Notre Dame? Hey, how come you got the halfback of Notre Dame and the hunchback of Notre Dame and you got the quarterback of Notre Dame? Is it any kind of coincidence, man? Anyone have any uh, ideas why that is? Yeah, I've heard of a uh, hyperwave Edward Park, man. Like uh, Elliot Wave on crack or something. Right, Elliot, uh, hyperwave says we're going to be going to friggin' 1200, right? Okay, well, that could take a while, so we're going to use shorter term charting to decide what we're going to do before we go to 1200. How about that? Where the, uh, where's the band of crypto monkeys? Where are they, man? <sighs> double mint, double twitch, double mitray, boom. Okay. And I gotta do better on my twitch. It sucks. <sighs> Rubs Vetus, are you kidding me, man? I feel so good. 
Ultra Instinct Jesus, man. Dude, there you go. Oh my god, Emily. Probes fetus tip $96.96. This is how baby Probes is coming out the womb. Get oh, wrecked, get M. Lee crap. Yeah, if that's the way it goes, uh, rest in peace, Emily's. Yeah, wow. That would be a. Uh, That'd be crazy though to have an ultra instinct child when they don't even have to like, you know, level up or what is it? You you bounce power levels so you're powering up. There we go, powering up, man. All right, probe says an ultra instinct Jesus baby. So does Emily. Might not feel good for Emily, but worth it, right? Thanks, pros, man. Holy crap! I need to set to keep that. Uh, alert box up a little bit longer on that variation holy crap man all right I guess that warrants another beer right probes is that uh, is that fair get another beer for that Probs, I just don't understand why you could have just split that up 25, 25, 25, and then 25, and then that could have been four chances of me having to chug a beer, right? All right, for Julia. Probs, what was that, man? I guess some things are more important than beer chugs, right? <clears throat> I feel like if you tip 9696, you're spoiling. It's like a spoiler alert for all of the world for Dragon Ball, right? But it's your own, own fault. Hyperwave equals old guy, old stats, crypto, new age. Yeah, dude. You know, uh, cipher patterns, harmonics were developed in the late 30s, man. So that's old school, too. So I guess you can call me old man, too. Whatever. But uh, this uptrend is historical and it's continuing up, right? get beer Julia uh, sorry that's not a lighting uh, variation right get beer exclamation mark try exclamation mark get beer and it might work all right thanks Bogle man for the light changes it's super crazy in here okay Roger says mostly he stopped buying crypto based on price and switched to buying by time and it's not Time to buy it. Looking for May time frame, and for May time frame to catch the third quarter rise. Uh, well, you know, like whatever. It's uh, dude. Their time to buy is when things are setting up to be times to buy. Nothing to do with when it is, where it is. Uh, like for instance, okay, historically Q4 is the mo most uh, or it's the best performing quarter for cryptocurrency in history, right? But Guess what happened this past quarter? We had one of the largest dumps we've ever seen. All right, biggest uh, drops in price we've ever seen. So it's such a fast time. All right, so what is it? Uh, previous price action, uh, you know, different areas of time did not uh, predict future performance. Hey, B slice, man, dude. Th oh. Balloon, alien, clinking Holy beer mugs, alien. Balloon. Dude, subs are like the heavy, very, very heavy. Thanks, uh, B Slice, for destroying the tip jar. You just blew it out, man. Thanks, dude. Much love, Kangs and Queens for Rachel. Cheers. You wish you could tip me some cannabis, man. I don't know how to do that. Perhaps Peter Burn. My dad is going to massage my hamstrings with evaporated milk, Kangs. Oh my god, dude. Let me uh, pull that up. Let me pull up a picture of that guy. Dude, the crew cut guy. Oh my god. Dude, thanks for the 25 uh, probes fetus, man. Uh, little giants. What would I say? Spike's dad. I can't believe I know his name or remember his name. Oh my god. <laughs> Here it is, dude. Oh, what? Dude, get that out of here. MySpace? This picture's on MySpace, dude. 
Wow. I got this dude. Here's a uh, Probst's dad. Or not Probe's dad, but Spike's dad. There it is, dude. Remember? He is a refrigerator refrigerator. Oh, we got the icebox versus Spike Man, the refrigerator dude. Only in pre pubescent reality can this exist, okay? Anyway. Whatever, dude. I remember the M&M's and the <clears throat> peanut butter and jelly sandwich inside the helmet for the fat guy. Do you remember that, Probes, man? Uh, things are just coming back to my mind right now. I haven't seen this movie. We should just do a showing of the little giants together. Okay, it'll be like that, that movie where they have the silhouettes in the bottom that are watching the movie and they're commentating on it and being funny. We should just do a private or public viewing of the little giants on YouTube. Get wrecked. Thanks, dude. One day, man. One freaking day. Seriously. We'll have the uh, the three percent hit, dude. I think it might require uh, Vet Moon Boy to probably play the numbers game on that. Certainly, and he's probably gonna be the one to hit it first. But uh, yeah, man, that's about it. Holy crap! He's coming out six foot, 185, six ounces, hot dog. Oh, okay, Jeff, get wrecked, dude. That's, there you go, man. Can't say much more about that. Massage your hamsters, rinse their sure, man. Just send them my way, P.O. Box. You got timed out. Why you, you regret, SD, what'd you even do? Did you get timed out? I don't know, man. Yeah, little giants, Mr. Spinner, man. You loved that girl? Oh, yeah, you loved the icebox? They wanted her... Society wanted her to be a cheerleader. They wanted her to be a cheer, cheerleader, Mr. Spinner, but she wouldn't let it happen, man. Monthly bullish... Uh, dude, I, I don't really look at the monthly... Really, for that matter, the weekly too much on crypto. There's just not enough historical data. All right. Daily is wonderful. Daily is going to set you free. But that's probably your most reliable slow time scale. Weekly's fine, though. We're looking at Bitcoin. Bitcoin's showing weekly bullish divergence now, man. At some point, it'll play out. But when, right? When will the weekly bullish divergence play out? Exactly. Thanks, Tim, man. Tim C. Kokakaru. Am I saying it right? Uh, no. Kojikaru. Kojikaru. Thanks, dude. All right, Mac Daddy, man. Have a good one, dude. Sleep well, brother. Yeah, dude. We, we got like uh, six likes away from 100 for fireworks, y'all been live for an hour and 48 minutes and we don't have a hundred likes times are tough it is a like depression or recession right now okay Whew. was is Zoltec oh yeah dude yeah you got to play against him dude and you said he was a relatively nice guy wasn't crazy or anything he wasn't psycho man I wish there was a way for Google to do multiple colors. That'd be amazing. Um, because I've got like four lights in here that are all, look at the strip too. But uh, yeah, man. Alex says, need crypto in that free to play game Fortnite or something. <sighs> Fortnite, multi-billion dollar video game. Uh, it grossed more money than Binance did in 2018. Unreal, dude. Phew. 
Monday morning, 10 a.m. Eastern. What, SD man? All right, sorry. So, Marine Star, hook me up with that uh, Tigger dude, right? The exact Tigger you want, dude, okay. Because, you know, typing in JPN225 doesn't work, all right? Oh, I think I saw it, maybe. Oh, I found it, dude. I found it. I wanted it. Okay, sweet. Okay, JP to go. Gotcha. It's got a beautiful down seven channel, that's certain. Could be a descending brighting wedge, probably not. Oh, that's just beautiful, man. Just freaking beautiful, man. Alright, dude, so let's see uh, what happens. Hey, another, another one, man, right? On the daily, uh, do you expect uh, this to be a swing high or this one? I mean, like, you could definitely do this one, but it would probably make more sense, man. An another one of these, but this is a higher low. Okay, the higher low, different game, and I don't think we're gonna meet the criteria for the B touch point, okay? Okay. We'll see if we can get it, all right? This will be a bearish bat as well. Again, I don't know, though, if uh, we will meet. Dude, it's awful close, man. That's a 35% retrace, okay? 35% retrace. Uh, we need a 38% retrace. So 3% off. Uh, so it could maybe be valid, but uh, then again, maybe not. But we know it didn't meet what we're looking for. Right here, that meets the criteria. And then we're looking for an 886 retrace, okay? 886 retrace is up, way up here, dude. So we're looking for there, okay, man? But that right there is kind of alarming because that was not good enough of an actual retrace. All right, let me make sure if there's anything we can do. Any wiggle room on the wick? No, dude, that's pretty much like freaking perfect there. Yeah, dude. Mm, just we don't have enough of a retrace there to maybe make it a valid pattern. But let's see what happens at 88%, okay? Because uh, I've seen many of these patterns, they are right around the criteria met, and uh, it still is fine, all right? So um, it's your bearish bat pattern, man. Everything meets except that B. Everything, all the criteria is met for potential harmonic, okay? So again, this thing could just, like, whatever, 88. But here's the thing, man. You got to break this down subbing resistance, which will not be easy, dude. That's uh, around uh, 21,170 or something, okay? So, uh, a long way to freaking go. But then people can make the argument that this was the swing high. This would be what we would do, right? So, uh, again, all up for interpretation here, okay? 886, in this situation, right up here at like 21,575. Uh, this is the case you do meet criteria okay if and this could do seriously could be right okay where well, you have a major high you mean it's a discernible swing out you can see it high to low 45 percent retrace so you are fine there um, 80 percent boom fine um and now all you gotta do is you're not too far off so uh it's tough man it's tough to sometimes with these daily highs when it might be discernible, it, it pretty much, and you can clearly see it here, right? So, just things to think about. Okay, let's leave it like that for now and see what happens. It's valid here, definitely valid there. Anyway, this is why having these <laughs> harmonics, man, it's tough, dude. It's like, as long as you know the fibs, you can go back to your book for guidance to make sure you're meeting the criteria of each. Eventually, you know, memorize whatever, it's fine. Mm, fireworks, sweet man. Thank you all so much for the 100 likes. Y'all are amazing. Kings and queens. Amazing. <sighs> I 
though. Well, there you go, dude. There you go, Rune Slayer, man. <clears throat> That's it, dude. Kangs. This is the pattern, dude. This is the pattern. That's all it is, man. Look at the... Jeez. Volume receding. Positive momentum. Plenty of it still. So it could still run. Uh, but you got to break above this 50-day uh, moving average, right? 20,993. And then, of course, the downsloping resistance. These could be areas also where a short could be uh, applicable or it could be appropriate, right? Before we get up to this level. Just saying. Dot for typing, get wrecked, SD. Get wrecked. Fork enough. Yeah, all those kids playing Fork Knife should play uh, Crypto, right? Kappa, because they don't have any money, right? So. There's just enough some channel you got going on that, okay? Okay, sweet. Kings. Dude, oh my god. Dang it, dude. Oh, the shorts are rising. The priesthood rises. Oh, man. Shorts are so low, dude. Looks like we're going to dump again. Okay. Good logic, man. Anyway. I wish there was more talking about, man, with Bitcoin. Just really waiting. Okay. Fortnite players get ZRX. Is that true, man? Rumor has it Bulkowski was born January 1st, 1957. Uh-oh. Bulkowski is born on New Year's. Be thighs. Alright, so uh, it looks like uh, the rumor of Facebook and Zillica teaming up is a baseless rumor. We'd like to ask everyone to refrain from sharing such fake information. Yeah, right. I bet the stupid marketing companies probably has something to do with that, probes, man. I mean, like, oh, yeah, Virgin Microsoft, man. Oh, my God, Zillica and Facebook, dude. Oh, yeah, man, ZRX and uh, Alibaba, man. Come on, give me some more. Give me some more. Virgin Pornhub, Kappa, that really happened. Okay, and it was bad. Maybe temporarily, Alex. Possibly temporarily. <sighs> anyway. I don't know, man. Just uh, hanging out with y'all. 
all 93 of y'all on uh, 1 a.m. past 1 a.m. Eastern. Been live for two hours now. But thank y'all for the likes, though. Seriously, surprised. Surprised we got 100 man. Crypto market, uh, the sentiment, dude. It's not like I cover. I'm a crypto guy, man, dude. I was into TA long before freaking crypto, man. At the most people are just obsessed with crypto, and when crypto sucks, people stop showing up. Amazon with Verge, dude. Yeah, dude, it's coming, man. It's coming, dude. Whoa, you get a thousand, thousand bucks gives you a million next year, right here. Whoa, dude, really, really? I don't think so, man. Heck of a gamble. temperature in Greenbow? I don't know, man. I'll find out. Thirty-six degrees right now, man. Thirty-six degrees. Wait, what's up, uh, boo time, bud time, bud time? Maybe if I do RL stream, I'll have more success. Let me try it. Okay, man, here we are, dude. Here we are. It's a IRL stream, man. Uh, just hanging out now, man. Okay, hanging out with the peoples, dude. Ask me anything. AMA, dude. AMA time. No more charts. Okay, we've you've lost your chart privileges. Okay, we've just looked at charts too long. It's okay though. So, about uh, Keith Currency Committee, you're back. Good to see you back, man. Thanks for making it. Hope you like the overlay, the changes, all that. We're no longer a TA stream. We're just an IRL sit here and sometimes eat stream. Okay. It's hilarious, dude. Thirty more cents to five eight nine. Here we go. Here we go, Billy man. We're almost there, dude. Fogel says CX. CX in the chat, baby. Can you tell uh, Ice Poseidon to give me some of his viewers? Okay, because, uh, yeah, man. <laughs> anyway, not really. I don't know if I. I don't know, dude. It's like so double edged of a sword, man. Do you want mass viewers or, you know, lots and lots of trolls? I don't know, man. It's just too much. Yeah, Mobius, it seems like I did get the PC fixed up. Um, we manually changed up the RAM settings and SLI'd the GPUs. Since we SLI'd, dude, there have been very little problems, which is weird. I didn't think it would have anything to do with that since the encoding for OBS done is from the CPU, from Threadripper. So. That's right, Jeff, man. Most uh, real long-term Bitcoin people are way under a thousand. <sighs> Don't believe in free will or determinism. I believe in free will, man. Free will, right? Um, let's say, man. Um, I made some. 
you know, bad decisions. Oil glut wasn't very fun. Okay. Oil glut wasn't fun, but uh, I got really lucky, man. Like on Activision and NVIDIA. I, I think I got in just so, like, when the global financial crisis happened, dude, I was like in college. So I was lucky there. I think uh, when you start trading or you start learning about charts, sometimes you get lucky or unlucky, okay? Imagine getting into charting, and I think really the that's the Wyckoff thing, right? The one guy, the composite operator. Um, I didn't get in particularly because the market was pumping or dumping or anything like that, right? I just got in because I just started learning about you know investing for my dad, and then just kind of or started learning about candles and just fell in love with it randomly, okay? Um, but a lot of people will get in because they get sucked in like by something like a great FOMO or previously this stock market run that we had like up to October like I think that pulled in a lot of people too so uh, I kind of looked out in regards of just timing um, but that's good it's fine but like uh, because the worst thing you can do is be successful immediately when you start trading because you have no idea like uh, you start gaining false sense of uh, confidence it's that Dunning-Kruger thing um, and then you start uh, taking you probably start with those high risk if you're just going in but uh, I don't know man paper strategy is really good just keep working on your formula uh, taking different pieces from different individuals that are successful and start making your own strategy your own trading strategy uh, Tim man so um, yeah I got hit kind of hard with the glut the oil glut but uh, also looked out with video game stocks and GPU stocks, semiconductors. So, um, yeah, I consider myself kind of lucky uh, getting into the markets. But a lot of people here got didn't even care about charts until crypto. So uh, that just wasn't me. So. Do you like Uber for your uh, main job, or is this like a sad thing, Jay? You think in the next hype, people will be looking for more insightful streams like mine? There's a lot of crap streams out there. Oh, dude, do you see, man? They, those crap streams are kind of the reason why I started uh, streaming, man. Uh, Lolly well, me kind of had the same mentality about uh people like during the great fomo spreading so much misinformation about the charts and stuff like not they they didn't even know what they were doing they just went live and they were successful because there were so many people that wanted to just be in this market so um did i see that alex cobb got like a thousand dollars in donations two days ago uh no i didn't see that but hey man he uh he deserves it he's a He's a bright young mind uh, who's on the right course, and um, there's just not enough of that Rune Slayer out there. So I'm very happy to hear that Alex Cobb got a thousand dollars in donations um, two days ago. That's that's fantastic, Rune Slayer. Been nothing but love for that guy. All right. You love sushi? Is it sushi? Is that like sushi? Yeah, same thing. AMD is very, very particular with RAM and settings. <clears throat> Not set right, it can cause your CPU to be lost. Or yeah, dude, we we learned that. Well, the thing is, dude, we I can't even get it up to 3,600 megahertz. Uh, we set it to like 33 and change megahertz because that's the top. Like if you go to the uh, motherboard website, like it only goes up to 3,300. When we when we put uh, the RAM manually, uh, the settings to 3,600 mega, megahertz transfer speed. Uh, we were getting bl blue screens. We were getting charts of death or, you know, screens of death. I don't know why. So we went to the 3300, and ever since we went to 3300, everything's been good. No problems. So we should left it alone. I don't know, man. It's the MOBA, though. <clears throat> so Mario, dude. You too have a blessed Sunday as well, Mario. Mine. Do I bowl? Yeah, I'm my bowling ball. I'm a lefty too. That hook ball, baby. Yep, still alive. Economist. You got into 4X and charting from your high school friends. And the first teacher you had was Reza. 
Mokhtarian. He ended up being a fraud, but it's been an amazing opportunity. What was it that made him a fraud, Renslayer? What was it? Okay. So. Alright, dude. What, what was he doing that made him fraudulent? Was it him, like, just being uh, pretentious in his teachings? That he was just speaking out of his butt and was wrong? And, that, and that's literally, like, what we saw, Larley and me were seeing all the time in the Great FOMO, where people pulling up charts and just talking out their butt about random stuff. I mean, looking at the five minute chart and one minute chart, dude, what were, the, I don't understand what they were doing. Uh, people saying that multiple variables are wrong. Like, I, I don't know, man. Like there's a lot of misinformation being spread and uh, it was definitely a motivation to get us going. Well, I, I started, I mean, things happen, man with the uh, hyped on crypto crap man uh, I don't know I didn't even talk about it <sighs> you remember so many youtubers doing TA on coin market cap charts it was just an S show so many BitConnect ads seems so long ago almost like a dream but remember things that were forgotten were not meant to be forgotten <laughs> probes man like uh, the one ring to rule them all right the one scam to rule them all, BitConnect. It's still around, dude. <clears throat> okay, BitConnect right now is at the bottom of that lake. Don't forget about it. Don't forget how scammy it was. Yeah, of course, Ricky W. Of course, man. Happy birthday, Kappa. Light speed wasn't good enough. I was going for ludicrous speed. Lord Helmet. He was selling hundreds for a forex course for uh, that he what, had not even made yet. He never ended up making any courses, and then just dude, that's so like, what's the point, dude? That's like peanuts, dude. Peanuts. Like it, dude. Be genuine and uh, have a long sustaining career doing this, or be like all the great FOMO YouTubers, right? That like were flashes in the pan. Uh, they were there, they made a decent amount of money, a good amount of money, and then disappeared forever, right? Or you could really, really actually help people for an extended amount of time over and over and over every day, impact people positively, and wait for the next run to come, help people invest in themselves for years or months, two years, and then uh, we can all be kings and queens together, right? I just don't get the whole instant gratification of scamming people to just do it the right way man there just aren't enough people doing it the right way in this world okay so glad to hear you're uh, getting back to even rune slayer man that's amazing dude mastering your emotions uh, is key if you read uh trading in the zone by uh, mark douglas rune slayer if you're talking about mastering emotions dude because he will help you master your emotions it's a fantastic book check it out if you haven't <clears throat> trading in the zone. What's up, uh, Atlant Cap? You too, Ricky Man. What's the current topic? You don't want to intercept my flow. Interception! Uh, it's just whatever, man. I don't know. We went IRL stream. Okay, I don't do IRL stream very often, so it's late, very late in the stream. I've been out live two hours, 13 minutes now. We've covered charts, Forex, stock market. OTCs, God, uh, covered it all really. So, uh, just hanging out now, IRL. That's it. And I'm glad to hear that. Uh, Rune Slayer is always an honor, man. Okay. Yeah, no, dude. It's just those bots, man. The algos can destroy you so easily on the short time scales so it's just like hey man it, it, it's your prerogative and it's your strategy you got to find out what kind of trader you are it's like the first thing you need to find out do you want to be a day trader or swing trader or do you want to invest right do you want to be like <clears throat> position trader which is positions like swing trading but it's like you can hold positions for like weeks before hitting target which is fine you can be a mix of swing trading and position trading okay which i like doing Trading in the Zone is the best book you've ever read, and you've watched all his videos, seminars. 
Rest in peace. Yep. I mean, sir, I'm glad to hear it, man. Then you're definitely on the right track, man. Okay. <clears throat> Alex just joined the Discord, man. Hey, man. Welcome. Welcome, Alex, dude. Boom. There's an official, official welcome. Okay. For me. Kings. <clears throat> Scam I am Ripple Riddler. Who is that, Billy Man? Is an actual person? I'm hanging out, Randy Schultz, man. Hanging out, dude. Yep, just drinking a beer. Whatever. It's about cheese, dude. My third beer. Whatever. Come on, probes, man. You gonna get me to chug a beer? You think you can try your luck, man? I don't think you can, dude. We can go back. To the charts, man. We can go back to the charts. Who cares? Are there any economic incentive benefits from a near-perfectly distributed token? Dude, I don't know, man. Okay, this uh, is probably not uh, the best stream to, you know... Ask that question, and it's a perfectly good question. I would think, uh, economist man, but uh, I use technical analysis on the four-hour daily and weekly time scale to make decisions on where the chart could be going next. All right. So, in terms of crypto, uh, I don't know if I knew the answer to that, to economist man. I'd be happy to answer, but I don't. I don't know that. So, and I'm never going to act like I know something I don't. Right. So, but hey, you got plenty of streamers out there that would do that, right? Rinslated my stream from last night gets striped for music. It did not, man. It did not. And I woke up and my I can't believe this, dude. It's still up and it's still up right now. So no, it did not get struck. It did not get uh, smited or smote. Smoted. Something. No idea. Uh Economist say, does anyone else in chat know? Uh we have a lot of uh, smart people in this chat, this uh, community economist man, so uh, I'm sure others might have a, an idea. People, you know, economists ask it. And if you know anything about protocols, what benefits can perfect distribution do for a POS network? Something, something like PIVX, right? Uh, I don't really know, man. I don't know. Sure, of course, economists, man. Stick around because though I might not know, uh, we have incredibly um, intelligent people in this community. And you're catching this stream, man. It's a late night stream now. Um, I stream twice a day and. Uh, 5 Eastern and 11 Eastern. So, uh, we, we have more people in here. We got 88 viewers right now. Normally, you know, in around 150, 200, sometimes 300. Just depends on the market sentiment. So, Lars asleep of the will. Yeah, pretty much. It was easier to day trade a decade ago. Yeah, I bet, man. I bet, pros, man. So Rick Schmitz, man. Welcome, dude. It's so funny, man. Rick Schmitz and Randy Schulz, those names, they are different, but they're the same. Mm, oh, yeah. I moved that to $25. Jeff is no luck. Except that I said yes. Ha. Get wrecked, probes, man. Get freaking red, uh, wrecked, probes, man. Yeah, I would, say, I would say so, too. He did get uh, pretty lucky. Need to get lucky, okay. So, hey Emily, thanks so much for the 25. I can't wait. Uh, are you getting big yet? Are you getting ready to burst? Okay. And uh, <clears throat> when little probes comes out, is he going to uh, go ultra instinct on you? Because uh, I just uh, I, I couldn't imagine that pain. Okay, that you're gonna feel, but uh, we're all with you. Okay, when you're giving birth, I want you to think about this whole community cheering you on. Okay, and me being saying, Kappa! <laughs> Thanks, Emily, for the 25. Yep. Because, you know what's crazy? Uh, dude, it's like every time you're, we're getting the John Mayer, uh, no John Mayer, four 25s tonight, and all Tom Brady getting sacked. No John Mayer's freaking out. Weird. Thanks again, Emily. You're amazing. 
Schulz is a very common name in Germany. It's like Smith or Schmidt. Ah, interesting. Mr. Schulz, man. Thanks, dude. Holy crap. Sweet economist, man. Glad you're, uh, you'll be chiming in, dude. Okay. But hey, you know what? There's probably things you can teach me, man. Okay. I was, I, I've never, ever claimed to know it all, and uh, I'm always trying to increase my knowledge of all things, including crypto. Okay. Because crypto is extremely uh, complicated, right, on the technological side. So, late night chilling, Jimmy, man. That's it, dude. That's it. Isn't the volume concerning me? No, oh, man, we got receding volume, dude. Dude, like since uh, the top here, since we sold off, I'm gonna be getting lows, lower lows, or the technical lower low on candle closes. Uh, we're getting lower levels of volume. That's good, man. That's a great sign. And, and the harmonics there. Um, and what? We hit one of our targets already. We've hit the 37.52 target. So, hey, I'd. I'm okay now, um, and the thing is, we could go lower, man. We could go down the 1414, and this pattern could still be valid. Because we only barely hit the 1272 FIB extension, right? That was it. Uh, on Coinbase, on Bitfinex, we had the uh, 140% retrace, which is awesome, dude. I mean, this is so perfect. But I had to go to the bathroom again, okay. My Little Probe's due in a few months. That's right, Alex. That's right. But it's, it's like My Little Pony, but My Little Probe's. So, Pablo, man. Feeling like a bit at home. Feeling like a bit. What is a bit? I like to know one bit. That means you feel like one cent right now, Pablo. You don't feel well, man. I uh, hope, hope you feel about. Hope you feel like a million bits, dude. Okay, Pablo, man. Well, every trade you partake in, Renslayer, is uh, certainly a gamble. Okay, and you know that because of you read Mark Douglas's book, right? It's all gambling. It's actually tougher. It's actually more extreme than gambling. Because at least in gambling, right? When you go to a traditional casino, uh, you say you go to walk up to the blackjack table, an example from the book, right? And it talks about uh, you know exactly what you're going to wager. And that's to, to the extent of how much you will wager. And you know whether you win or lose when you're going to... Uh, what you'll lose or what you'll win, right? And the thing with trading is you have an unlimited amount of losses or gains... And so it's not as simple at all. Okay, it's tougher trading than actually gambling at a casino. So, whatever. If whales buy a POS network, it's no longer distributed. Wrecked, right? You are huge, Emily. Still about two months ago. The drugs better be strong. No, no, Emily. I've already called the hospital. I told them no matter what you say when you get there, Emily Grout wants all natural. Okay, she wants to go and be natural, a natural uh, pregnancy or a natural birth. Okay, right, Emily. Don't be mad at me. Okay, when they don't let you. Okay, use those strong drugs. All right. Washington, Chile, Pablo, man. Thanks, dude. All right, be right back. I gotta go back. Well, I broke the seal, right? So, let's group. Hang tight.
All right, sorry, I'm back. <sighs> My God, how far has this community come? It's been a, just a long year. Really not so long, has it? It's been relatively fast uh, how time's gone by. I've had a lot of good times, a lot of bad times, a lot of struggles, a lot of adversity, a lot of enemies and antagonists, right? So much that we're now well into season five of Game of Coins. Season five, y'all, okay? Crazy. Patience works with crypto, not gambling, though, sometimes. Sometimes. Very mellow. Randy Shield, man, glad you like it, dude. Our inherent emotional instincts uh, set us up for failure and becoming a successful trader, trader is basically the process of retaining your brain. <sighs> yeah. It's great, man, when it clicks, though. When it clicks, it's uh, fantastic, dude. You start getting the FOMO feeling, but for coinciding variables on entries. I love that, man. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're getting there, Ricky, man. We're getting there. Uh, really, for that, uh, February 9th was the first time I ever soloed and made content on my own on that platform. Yes, February 9th will be a the real, true one-year anniversary. Okay. The 23rd was the first time I ever streamed. Uh, but it wasn't me. It was, uh, there was no face of me. It was not. It was just different, man. All right, but... February 9th is the big 365 day solo Ray on his own streaming with no collaborations, right? So, looking forward to that date. It's not too far off at all. Is it's the 27th of January? 40,000 buy order at 34.50. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Wonderful. Yeah, we're still off, Skyward, man. Not for long, though. Not much longer. I just, right, you kind of run out of things to do as a streamer, right? You know, lots of coins. I don't. I don't have any Fortnite to play, right? Or Fork Night. So uh, all I can do is drink and just hang out with y'all. Okay, the IRL stream time. Is it? What's the current uh, Bitcoin sentiment? Uh, no one gives a crap. That's what I've learned anyway. People stop caring. Especially with sideways movement. Okay. Been sideways, but dude, poised to make higher prices. Alright. <clears throat> Julie says I look a lot happier and more relaxed than a year ago. Absolutely. Having, having literal Julia leeches leeching off me. Uh, you know, they did a little bit, but not to the extent of what they were wanting, right? They were. I was literally the, the workhorse doing everything for them and they didn't even care about charts or technical analysis. All they wanted to do was just make passive income off of you, the viewers. That's what they wanted. They didn't care about you and, and they just wanted me to help y'all and they would get 82% uh, of the Patreon. For what? What were they doing? Nothing. You get it? Nothing. They were literally... The whole epitome of crypto, okay, scammy. And then I think they probably sold my information. Uh, I had to give them my social security, my phone number, my address, everything for the 1099. Uh, where do you think uh, all of a sudden that doxing came from, Julia? Well, really, I mean, like, how did they get it? Wait, there's no other way. There's no other way besides them, okay? It had to come from them. Whatever, dude. Maybe it wasn't, dude. Maybe I just, uh, maybe not, man. February 9th, the same date the Beatles appeared on the Ed Sullivan Show, 1964. Well, there you go, Billy, man. It's a uh, fate, dude. It's fate. You got people over? Complete Bitcoin teaching? Skyrim, man, I know you do, man. I know you did, dude. Kangs. I really appreciate it, man. All right. It's a group effort. Uh, when something bad happens to me, it happens to y'all. When something good happens to me, it happens to y'all. Right? It's just... That's the way it is when you got a, an actual real community of people that genuinely care about you. Love it. Okay. They did sound like pimps, didn't they, King Logan? Yeah, they were they were using me. I was the, the prostitute, I guess. The call girl. Whatever. Or they're a little stupid pyramid scheme. Whatever. 
And that's why they're no longer around. Exactly, Julia. Exactly. Because uh, you know, they weren't the ones that knew what they were doing or cared. They did. Dude, it's like, I ain't done crypto. Hey, how funny funny was that is that name right like how much of a joke is that name hyped on crypto like literally we couldn't be furthest the furthest thing away from hyped on crypto at this point right man no one cares it's not there's no hype anymore and that's the whole like that name is almost like it's the worst thing dude it's like hype is what gets people killed on these markets dude destroyed hyping out on things okay yeah fomo baby get ready to lose everything and then 200 300 percent afterwards okay they found a customer for that right what do you mean julia thanks mr spooner man oh dude yeah dude no one why would like because dude when you break it down it's like they don't provide enough value to take what they're trying to take okay not even close Well, RuneSlayer, whether you do or you don't, man, it doesn't make much of a difference, man. Uh, as long as, look, you know how you can tip me. Just come in here, uh, ready to learn, and invest in yourself. That's it, dude. That's all I care about. Okay. That's right, SD. Rags with a three. Yes, sir. We are the 4,000 SD. Yeah, we already the 4,072. Holding strong, man. Can't grow much, no more growth, but uh, maybe we've just bottlenecked, we've capped out on a technical analysis stream. Um, there's only a certain amount of people that can stomach my personality, as well as the music playing and everything else, right? So, that's cool, man. Dude, if I don't grow anymore, I don't really care, dude. Because I know I'm affecting people positively every single day, the people that do care. And we get one or two new people that come along once every week or two. That's good enough for me, man. All right. I'm, I'm very grateful for what I have. And when you're grateful for what you have, you can't be disappointed about the things you don't have. Okay. Virility. Who cares about going viral? It doesn't even matter, man. It's like, congratulations on going viral. For what, dude? The goblins taking profit room. So, yes, the goblins. What about the, uh, about the uh, orcs taking profit? Mordor. Whatever. Nah, dude. Mitchell Love. I'm drinking a Mitchell Love, Alex, man. Oh, yeah. I'm not. Oh, I'm not mad, Scar. You know I'm not mad, dude. I am. I have transcended. I'm cer cer certainly in a better place, man. Okay. I ended up uh, losing $24,000 to them uh, that they owed me and they never paid me. And I still have never received that and didn't get it. And at this point, it's all a laughing matter. But at the time, it was extremely uh, betraying. And what they did to me after all I had done for them, but they didn't expect at all um, the revenue to come from tips because they it's snipers too. Uh, the way it, the, the formula worked before was all Patreon. That's where the money came from, the Patreon, not the tips. And so they set it up that way, and then they realized they were getting the short end of the stick, like four guys, five guys. Well. Uh, Bradford didn't count like they treated him like dirt too like he's just a lowly editor employee um, and so uh, yeah they they were really pissed that they didn't even understand that tips would be the primary source of revenue for hyped on crypto right so uh, they tried running me off getting me out of there so they could get another content creator in who didn't care much about uh, money this didn't expect much and uh, yeah but hey you know what man I'll give them, give them the benefit of the doubt. I didn't even know. How would I, how would I have even known, right, that uh, I was going to be successful, or any, whatever you want to call it. Is it a su success? I don't know, man. It's, um, I don't even know what it is I'm doing right. All I'm trying to do is just help people. That's it. That's literally it. Okay, just trying to teach the things I've learned from way smarter people than me, and I'm trying to articulate it to you, the audience. That's all I'm trying to do, man, and trying to have some fun with it music and rgbs and all that stuff man just trying to have fun and reinvest in the stream okay so you man bro it's coward man i'm very grateful for benito dude that guy's a legend man that guy's a freaking le how do you how does one ever insult someone on their stream 
and they literally accidentally called the top before it got delisted months later. Okay. That's crazy, dude. I've never seen anything like it in my life, dude. I think it's so cool what Benito did by insulting me when literally it made one little small lower high. And then that was the highest high we ever saw ever again before it got delisted. That's so crazy, man. You can't make that up. And that's so bad. That's like the worst, okay? I, I can't imagine how bad that guy felt, probably. Like, in, like he went to bed knowing that he did that. That's legendary, dude. Yeah, man, Activision, man. My gut, dude. Emerging markets in Asia, dude. 75% uh, of the money that uh, the revenue in the video game sector comes from Asia. Um, very, very exploding. Um, I guess the population is exploding there. Young, young minds, young people. Uh, with that data and that stuff, I uh, went deep on Activision. You know, around $18 a share. And went nuts and uh, finally closed out almost all my position at $75 a share before the whole fiasco with Diablo and BlizzCon and all that. So uh, that was a gut thing. That was a fundamental thing. But guess what? Remember, it's not crypto, dude. Those things that that company made money and is continuing to make money even with it getting destroyed right now. Okay. A lot of turmoil with that, that stock, that asset. But uh, yeah, man. It wasn't, it was not a TA move. <clears throat> Jeff, I got it cheap for uh, 24000 Yeah, I did. I guess so, man. I guess so. <clears throat> it is such a change, man. And it's people like you that help me get through it, dude. Okay. Love you, dude. Extremely successful community, I guess. And it wasn't me that built it, it was all of us. Uh, dude, I'm just one freaking guy with a webcam and a mic. Who cares, right? A pretty cool PC now because of y'all, right? Really, and this is just that PC, right? Looking at it, that is me showing and and swearing fealty to you, the viewers, because that is all to make the stream freaking better, okay? Smoother, crisper, uh, things we can do graphically. It's all to give back to you, okay? So, can't imagine how many streamers have made money and done whatever they wanted with it okay so and not reinvested it in the stream okay i've gone all in on this yeah we did jeff man we need to find him dude you'll never find him dude he's like probably i don't know in an outhouse somewhere in italy or something dude glad to uh, enjoy it do see man Well, we, know, we get 100 likes uh, almost every stream, right? But, uh, you know, dude, I live in Alabama, so uh, that's a big no-no. Okay, man, extremely illegal here. Dude, they literally will throw the book at you. Hold it. Benito and his three daily dislikes. Dude, we got more enemies than Benito at this point, Billy, man. <sighs> Don't even need to name them out, dude. Don't even. Crazy man, crazy. Uh, Rinsler Torre K. No, dude, I don't. Sorry. Whew. Is that the band of crypto monkeys? How many uh, crypto monkeys uh, does Crypto Kirby have to deal with, Billy Man? How many? Let me know. Thanks. A band of crypto monkeys. It's got to be like ten plus, right? A band. No, a boy band like in Sync or Backstreet Boys, right? Six months we went from a really low spot to IRL streaming courtside in LA when we didn't even have tickets. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, yeah, man, it's truly humbling and a blessing. And uh, 
I cherish it every freaking day. All right, man. It's just like been wonderful, man. Are you an Alabama man, DC man? Are you? If you weren't broke AF, you would buy a candy crimson chopper. Yeah, you would. Be careful, man. You can ride bikes your whole life, and it might not be your fault. What if your tire blows up? Not much insurance, right? You love this fam. We wouldn't have found one another if I had not decided to start streaming. I, mean, I guess that's true, but, uh, you know, y'all stuck around and helped grow it, right? I mean, the safe bet would obviously be the Patriots, but, uh, I don't know, man. I'm seeing the bearish Pat harmonic, and this makes me think the bearish Patriots, right? The bearish Pat. That makes me think uh, that the Rams might win. Because it's an omen, man. It's an omen, man. Yeah, everything does happen for a reason, I believe. You don't know, Billy Man, but me and Kirby are only about two YouTubers that you watch. Because we tell it like it is, man. Well... I don't think that guy even knows that I exist, but uh, doesn't he have lots of, like, thousands and thousands of followers, right? He's the poker player, right? The rounder. Yeah, SD helicopter. Oh, it's a, heli it's a literal helicopter. It's not an actual chopper, as in, you know, because chopper, like, that's a common nomenclature for a bike, like a motorized bike, okay? Like a Harley Davidson chopper. Yeah, delivery alcohol, man. I didn't even know that was a thing, man. Okay. Party time, party time. I've got one more beer left in my fridge, y'all. One more. Okay, we got 75 viewers. We're screwed, man. Should I open the beer or just end it? Should this stream be ended? It's funny that uh, I bet Moonboy didn't even want to bet against uh, Tom Brady, man. Because that guy, Tom Brady, is a freaking goat. He's incredibly impressive. So is that secondary, or that skill set, you know, his uh, receivers and his freaking O-line, man. It's just a very complete offense, man. <laughs> Alcohol, you can deliver it, man. Let's do it, dude. I wanted to do it. Did we even do it, man? I don't think we did. We just went to MK's, right, and drank over there. Choppers are joints. Wow, I'm learning something new every day, man. It's crazy. Alright. I don't know, man. I don't know if I should drink it. I think I should probably just get off. Probably be wise, right? I don't know, man. It's just kind of like really late. Been live for two two hours and 45 minutes now. Overstayed my welcome. Extremely. End it all. Yep. In that stream. Who's changing colors, Vogel? That's you, dude. You're changing the colors. Unless the thing's set on, uh... Oh, crap. Crap. Drink high tea. No! Hey, Julia, thanks for the 500 biddies. Appreciate it. Sorry, I'm overlay for bits. Oh, I... You know what? I got this. Hold on. That's no, really easy. I can get that. I can get that. Show those alert box. Then I'll do Streamlabs. Try that again, Julia. Let's see how it goes now. I, I, oh, it's off now. Mm -hmm. It's weird, right? Here we go. Perfect. All right, Julia, give it a shot now on the biddies so I can see if it works at least for the full screen overlay. And it, or, or I will come there and end it for you. You sound like, uh, you will either go to sleep or I will put you to sleep, SD. Okay. 
the beer on sub. Oh, good, man. Oh, my God. Juliet, we just need... Just throw me, like, two bits. Two cents. Okay. Just so I can test this out make sure it's working properly on the full screen overlay. Thanks, Juliet. Unless you don't have the two... Any more bits. Two bits. Then we're screwed. Hit plaid. It's on, dude. Just turn on plaid, man. Oh, God, man. Don't you threaten me, SD. I ran a shul sleep well, brother. Mom. Nubian Abix. There we go, dude. It's my favorite uh, color. Favorite color, dude. Julia Guskuski says, hold on. All right. That's cool. Holy crap, dude. That is so huge. Thanks for, I needed to test though. Okay, it looks like the, that's good. This needs to shrink a little bit. Holy crap. That was huge. That's what she said. Okay, that should be good now though. Should be good, all right, let's wait. That'd be that man. Fortnite. Enjoy the Elka Skulski. Thanks so much to the 500 biddies and make it a little larger. Maybe we'll do it like right there. That looks good right there. That would be good. Okay. Perfect. Thanks to the 500 biddies. Uh, Julia. Do the eye tracker challenge like Greek God. What is it? The eye tracker challenge? That's good right here. This is good. Oh, no, dude. I think it's nothing to do with Threadripper. I think it's just... Uh, it was a little laggy right there, but I don't think... Dude, I think it's Streamlabs. It's nothing to do with... The Threadripper in that situation. Give me two bitties now. Come on, new bitties. Okay, I guess I'll get a beer. Whatever, dude. I miss being a man. If you're latering, I guess I'll latering too, man. Eye tracker challenge. No, uh, there is a breathalyzer uh, app that I can implement into my stream. I saw it. Uh, I want to do that. And. There's also a BPM, a beats per minute. I mean, that's... Dude, that is not the Threadripper. That is totally stream, stream lads. You see that lag right there. Good God. Nothing I can do about that. You want some I mean, that's it. Bitties. The laggy bitties, right? Here we go. See, it's like fine like that. It seems good. I, I like it there because uh, on the screen, just because like, you know, like right here. Yeah, I like it there because like, you can't read down there where all the colors and graphics are happening. Dude, that is super duper laggy, man. Alright, hold on a second. Yeah, 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 man. Hold on. I guess. I guess you'll talk me into it. But whatever, man. Just look up Greek God Eye Tracker Challenge some other time. They watch Twitch Thoughts and the Eye Tracker. Oh, I guess that's what happens when you don't have much value to bring. You should look at Thoughts on Twitch. This is where they're looking. It's so funny. How these guys get to so famous, man? Oh, bros, man, here Oops. come the bug jams. Oh, it feels so good. Here comes the explosion, dude. Uh, uh. Explosion, man, explosion. So at least we learned it. Nothing. To, it's a server side thing. It has nothing to do with uh, the thread ripper. It's just Streamlabs. Streamlabs, man. MK Man! Here's MK Man. We're gonna do some uh, applause while I get this beer. 
this beer is going to be devoted to y'all, y'all old schoolers, okay? MK. You're song, dude. That song reminds me of MK and Jules. Hold on. What's that song we played last night uh, by 311 that Bradford uh, suggested? Hold on a second, man. Let me, let me find this. It was so good, and I'd never heard it before, and I freaking loved it, man. 23, baby! 23. I'll find this thing, dude. You just give me a second. I'll find it, man. Rip my RGBs? I don't think so, man. Never, dude. Never! Well, this is a good one, dude. Uh, I'm scared, though. I'm a little scared. My stream getting taken down. But I don't really care, I guess. Oh, I found it. But I'm going to play this one first, okay? I'm going to play this song first, all right? Who cares what happens? Oh, dude. I'm definitely going to get my stream taken down for this one. I can't do it, dude. It's, it's literally the one. I'm li literally looking at the ones that have uh, taken my stream down before. Warner uh sme and uh, merlin y'all know merlin dude holy crap bob Trump. good god i want to play it so bad but i can't man i hate it so much what's okay though man play uh play this one use of time use of time No rinse there, not that one. This is one that I'd never heard before. Put a more chill light going on, thanks. This is not chill, dude. Not chill light. the sights and the sounds of the supercomputer that will take over the world. If you want me to change it up, I can. Which y'all like, dude? Which y'all like? What about those lights? It's called sequential right here. I mean, nice, bro. Cool. But every time I turn the volume down, all I hear is the deafening sound of your Oh, 
I guess what I'm gonna do is just get out of here. All right, just a, been a great stream. Uh, just a nice time hanging out with y'all. Not a 65 year. This is my overstatement. Welcome, all right. Good, uh, good song to end that on too. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, thanks so much for the love, the like, support, the one sub or something. Who cares anymore? We're not gonna gain subs anymore, and I don't even give a crap. So, uh, thank y'all for the contributions. We're gonna love y'all. So I'll be back uh, tomorrow sometime. I don't know if I'm going to make a day stream or not, but I'll try. Until next time. Respect for tea in a few days. Best bar, man.